so first off, how were your feelings when you saw the script and you saw Sloane and Nee are kind of separated again after that happy ending of season eight? Yeah. Well, I, again, we, we, Emmanuel have both have been in agreement about this. It was never my, I didn't interpret it that way at right. the end. I, to me, it didn't seem like they were back together at all. Yeah, no, they weren't back together. I think people People assumed, assumed that we were going to yeah. get back together, but that was... That was not the case. No. Yeah, it was supposed to be ambiguous. The thought was that they're going to go try to figure out how they're going to deal with each other and the baby and... Exactly. You know, being co-parenting. And yes. They were just going to figure it out together Because if or not. you remember, we hugged outside of the plane. Right. Oh, it wasn't yes. like this it big... Kiss. Yeah, yeah, there it was, was no a, big... Right. <laughs> dip dip by the plane. Yeah, it was like we so, hugged, like, okay, let's try to talk about yeah, how we're gonna raise gonna this go. kid. But I, I, I never felt... People would say that to me. I'm like, I, I didn't... I never took it that way. To me, yeah. it was always sort of ambiguous and, and mm -hmm. kind of, you know, we'll me see too. what happens. Oh, well, I feel like an idiot now. No, but, oh, but no, by don't. the way, you, you, you know, and well, that's what I'm that. saying. I, I'm, I'm actually was surprised to, to, feel, to hear it's maybe we did something wrong. <laughs> I, I was, but I was actually surprised at how many people felt that way, myself, when it, to me it felt clearer to us. That's what we were playing. Anyway. Yeah, exactly. And when you're on the, the set with the baby bump going on there, yeah. did you feel like there was a change in the chemistry, the way you acted against one another, that, that there was this kind of motherhood encroaching between the two of you? It was interesting. It was subtle. You know, I think that we still are, you know, E and Sloane. Yeah. I, but I feel like there was a subtle difference. And I feel like, I don't know, when I watched it initially, I thought to myself, oh, it's really fun to see them because Sloane has made this decision. Like, mm. so, like you're in, great. You're out, whatever. Like, I was having right. this kid. Yeah. And so there's this kind of, the funny banter, you know, at the doctor's office, I, it kills me. Yeah. With the text and the thing, yes. and I feel like there's a little like tiredness between them, right. or something like a little like, oh, whatever. <laughs> but it's funny too because you know, obviously we're we're close in real life as well. So it, it, you know, there's Emmanuel with this thing, and it's like, all right, come on, let's yeah. go. <laughs> you ready? Like you were, you're kind of helping her up, and then you know we would walk and be cut, and then we'd kind of help her waddle back to the, <laughs> the starting position and it's like everywhere she'd be like can you help me can you we grab me that water you, you grab that water for me she really so it was it was really kind of like she was pregnant and I, I was sort of kind of like the dad like taking care of the pregnant wife i was like oh i got it i got that don't worry what do you want you want water or what do you want you know it's i was trying so to true. trying to take care of her and at the end of the day like we'd be getting into our cars and i'm like oh wow look at you <laughs> you look great you look great. You really <laughs> lost a lot of weight. weight. Came yeah. right off. <laughs> Amazing. Uh, Malcolm McDowell doesn't appear in the movie, unfortunately. But how would you think Terence would feel about what happens with the two of you? And <sighs> it's amazing that he hasn't sent a hitman to my house. <laughs> Can you imagine? <laughs> For real. Yeah. So funny because he's such a good guy too. He's, such a, good he's guy. a great guy. Yeah. He's another very underrated. Uh, well, he, he, he was a guest a star. Well, yeah. He was a, played a, a real role, but yeah. you know that, it was a real pleasure to have a you know to be working with a guy, oh, an actor of that, that caliber. It's just the guy's like oh, on another planet. Yeah, um, I'm very proud to say he was my father. Yeah, <laughs> I'm, I'm, I just can't believe that he hasn't killed Eric Murphy yet. It's amazing. <laughs> Maybe for the sequel. Maybe for the really sequel. Dark, like, dark yeah, turn. Really dark turn. <laughs> so, what are your favorite cameo moments in this film? Were there people you were really excited to see and hang out with? Jessica Alba is never a bad. Fun to have on set for the day. I wasn't there. She killed it, though. Yeah, she's great. Um, I loved Liam Neeson. Liam Neeson, too. <laughs> yeah. Jessica Alba, Liam Neeson, huh? Yeah, what does this that is say? a pairing. Yeah. Something, something interesting about that. <laughs> Were there any moments in the film that you wish made the final cut that didn't quite get there? Everything made the final cut. Really? The only thing that didn't make the final there were the only, because it's, it's funny, because 99.9% .9 of movies, even good scenes, Yeah get cut, mm -hmm. whether or not because it may slow the movie down or whatever it may sure. be. But um, really the only things that got cut, unfortunately, were a few cameos. Oh. Yeah, because we had this day where it was like, listen, basically anybody that wants to show up and do a cameo, it was like an open season to, the, to the show The screening up. sequence. The, sc the screening right. sequence. Right. So there was a few moments there that ended up getting cut out. But in terms of the script, the script is completely intact, which is... A rarity. Yeah, phenomenal. Yeah. And it shows it's such a great film. So yeah, yeah, exactly. It's just naturally there. Well, thank you for watching. Great, time. thank you very much. Thanks for coming over. Take care. Thanks. All right, Have we'll see you day. later. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys. 
Hey, you guys, huh? Hey, you guys. Is yeah. that from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey, 